All right, so this one did come with some instructions. I'll be at very rudimentary. Not very uh, many of them. I'm to remove these bolts and retain them. So there's there's six six bolts. One, two in the back. Two in the front, and then two hex in the very, very front. Plastic factory skid plate is out now. The struggles of my dad. Huh? This is pretty robust. All right. So this bracket mounts there. And then your skid plate mounts to it. Problem is, guess what? The winch is in the way. So I'm gonna have to take that winch bracket off in order to slide this mounting plate behind it. Okay, so once you take, so I got the, uh, the winch bracket off and I want you to take those two top bolts that we initially took off and the shoulder washer which is these things off I think so we're going to barely tighten these on so it holds it in place and uh, put the bolts on the bottom here shortly so we have Insert four spring nuts into the sides of the reinforcement plate with the thread side towards the back. Once you get that down, align and install the front skid plate over the reinforcement plate with the rest of the stock hardware. Install the four M8 five millimeter hex drive stainless steel bolts into the front skid plate into the reinforcement plates so we're going to take these and slip them i guess i don't know So I'm guessing this hook on the back side instead of mounts to the front of it. But I don't know. I don't understand why these cutouts are there. If it didn't mount like this, it doesn't make any sense. There's a lot of play in there. Anyway, these spring clips they just pop in to here threads and back but so we are going to go ahead and clip the top on this bracket maybe i'll get rid of some of that play so we are not going to hang this over this bracket which seems to make the most sense but we're going to mount the plate to the front. It's got to be it. Stop. So when you get under here, there's that silly bracket. So I, I, I messed it up. You don't have to take your winch thing on. The bracket mounts to the front of that bar. You would think that hooks over, which made the most sense, but the holes did not line up it just i don't know I, so it mounts to the front the problem is when you get under here this bracket these holes on the bracket don't line up with the holes <laughs> don't line up with the holes in the machine at all so i'm gonna have to 
take a hammer or a screwdriver and tweak that plate over so you can get the damn bolt in there without cross threading it. Not a not a very good design.